Welcome to my channel, Planner with Maserati. I am going to be showing you my mini Happy Planner War uh, binder, you may call it. So before I begin, I'd like to tell everybody welcome. Please subscribe, hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Please give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. So with that being said, let's begin. Um, I went ahead and just used a cover that I just recently bought. Oh, mini Happy Planner cover. It says, let's root for each other and watch each other grow. I figured that would be good for faith. And the discs are from, oh my god, um, I forgot the name of it. It's not Agenda 52. It's in uh, Joanne's. And it's a new day-to-day -day planner kind of theme. I forgot the name of it, but it's in Joanne's. And if you look, you'll see there's no holes or anything. It's just glitter. I did have the black rings that came with the planner, but I took off my budget planner to put the mini. Because these were the rings that were on here. So let's begin before I ramble on. Okay, so the things that I've used are the Crafter Square double-sided tape. The glare is crappy. And again, Dollar Tree. It looks like a roll like this. You don't get a lot, but it's well worth it. Like, it's seriously well worth it just to leave in your planner bag and just be like, okay, or your Bible, uh, Bible bag. You're like, okay, I have tape, I'm gonna go. So that could go in the garbage now. And another thing I used is, let me see if I have it here. Oh my gosh, did I throw it away? Oh no, right here. So it comes a 12 by 12 uh, pack at Dollar Tree again. And it's the Crafter Square cardstock. I already used the pink up, which I would love to use in here, but I already used it up. So I'm using the purple and the green, the pastel. It is the cardstock, 12 by 12. It's 175 GSM. And that's the UPC if you're interested. I don't know of any other colors. I just know I picked this one up a while. And yeah, so that you'll see that in here. Another thing I used is the Planet Happy Life, Love Stephanie. And that's the CEO or was the CEO of the Happy Planner. And another one I used is the Southern Blues. And let me show you the ones I used. This one here, you'll see in there. And then that's that one. I wanted a subtle one, but with stripes. This one. So it's subtle with stripes. I liked it that. But there are some very pretty ones. And I think I'm going to cut these journaling cards out if they fit, which probably not. Nope, they don't fit. So anyway, that's the basic stuff that I used. Well, did you hear that go flying? I used, of course, the Recollections to cut the paper. Sorry for the glare, but it is the Recollections. It's very old. And last but not least, scissors, marker, pen. Well, this is the Sharpie pen. Um, and there's one more thing. Oh, tabs. To tab it out. Okay, so the pen I used, again, is the Sharpie pen. I know that was, like, bad at showing it to you. But it's the Ultra Fine, which writes lovely on your tabs. And the tabs, again, are from Dollar Tree. I wish I had the packaging or I would show it to you. But they're just the white. They're very huge tabs. You cut them in half and you get 12 in a pack. So that'll make 24 tabs total. But I use them everywhere. So yeah, there's that. And again, scissors. And then the pen I'm using, which I'm loving, is the Pilot Friction Ball 0.7. It is the erasable. And let me tell you, this pen writes beautifully. Okay, I don't know why we do that as a video. Adding on to what I did there, which I will show you in a minute, is I did some printables. I found stuff on the internet, which is 
some stuff is kind of small so I'll go in and resize which is the full armor of God I just went into Google image typed in the full armor of God this came up um, I got this from I have no idea I just recently got it it is the Bible the New Testament reading plan five minutes in five days five minute a day oh my god five minutes a day five ways to dig deeper in five days a week so you don't do i believe weekends so there's that and then there should be more though i thought no that might be the only page for it this is disciple journal disciple journal Disciple journal. I'm just making sure the pages. So this is October, November, December. I'm like missing some pages here. Let me find what I just did. November. Okay, so this goes with this one. For some reason it says Disciple Journal, but it came up. Because here's January through August. I'm assuming. Okay, for some reason this came up weird. Let me see what I did here. I'm going cray cray. If I cannot find it, then I'll just explain later or something. Oh, oh my god. Okay, so December through October and then January through September. I was looking at August and didn't see September. But it says Discipleship Journal, Bible Reading Plan. And then I'm looking, Discipleship, and I'm looking to see where does it say it on top. But these are the two that go together. The five by five, by five. And then there's another one called Discipleship Journal, Book at a Time Bible Reading Plan. So it's January, February. And then you'll see December here with October, but it's the way they, I guess, put it together. That's why it was confusing. And then March to September, and then October through December, January through February. So the way that this is, is like you make it into a book. So I was supposed to print it like if it was going to be a book, but I didn't. So that is why that was confusing. So this will go in here as Bible um, I don't know if I'll do Bible study or something like that. Bible reading plan, something like that. But that'll go in here as well. I just didn't have time to put it. The armor of God is in here. I do want to have a fruit, the fruit of the spirit. So I'm going to have to obviously cut this down a little bit more because my printer decided to go bigger. Ooh. So there's that. So let's dig deep into here. It says, let's root for each other and watch each other grow. Let me move this out the way. And again, this is a happy planner. I don't even remember which one that I picked up that it came from, but it's a good one. So here I just have, this is your one precise life. Live happy, live fully right now. Plan a happy life, number one. Thought that was pretty interesting. It matches kind of the color that's going to be in here. Well, a little bit off, but it's still spring looking. So, my brain dump. I have like my brain dump of things to do. That will not stay in here. I'm just doing this. So, when I carry this with me, I have pages I could brain dump. So, you'll see like this part of the half is more of me filming, my doctors, and then this part of the half is basically. Um, the faith so I probably will just end up making one faith brain dump in here like if I see something if I need something things like that which I do need because I need to buy I need to purchase okay so I did this that's done see I'm just getting it all together um here I need to buy um, I put Dollar Tree and I'll probably go Saturday after my doctor's 
stuff that I gotta do. I gotta have an echo cardiogram and an EKG. An echo for my I have a heart murmur and a leaky valve. And then the x-ray for when I had COVID, they want to go in and make sure that my lungs are not affected from it. People are having issues. So my first tab in here is index. That is where I'm going to have everything that's in here into my index. So this is the Dollar Tree cardstock. It is beautiful. Did I put it on the right side? No, I did not. It's actually the sheen. You, you don't, it really doesn't matter, but I like the sheen kind. So it looks like it's a very shiny. I couldn't even know if you could tell that the difference. And this is the dull side. So that is where this goes. So it looks shiny when you open it. Very pretty. Okay, so that's the index. And these are the top, uh, the top tabs. And these are the Dollar Tree tabs. I do have Avery labels in all of that, but I, I like the Dollar Tree ones because you can just cut them in half, make two of them, and then, I mean, you get a very good price. 24 for a dollar. But it originally comes 12 If you need the big ones, then by all means, but toward index, I don't need a big one. So my war binder sections. And I've seen this off of a Facebook group. I don't remember which one, but I've seen it off of there. I kind of like copied and, you know, I'm going to put my own stuff into here. War binder sections is going to be prayer. So that's the main heading. So that would be your top tab. Mother, brother, husband, daughter, answered, and jobs. Those are the ones that I put myself. Um, battled armor. So that's going to be, you know, putting your full armor on. Main heading, battle. God's word, the scriptures, main heading. I have not put anything for God's word yet, and I did not leave space for God's word yet. Oh my gosh. And then Bible study. That's the main heading. So that would be faith, journaling, faith, mapping, Bible words and verses, faith, mapping, Bible characters. Um, five, spiritual abundance. God told me, Holy Spirit gave me. Okay. So with that, we have... Six, my duty. That's going to be, again, a top tab. It's gratitude, praise, thanks. I was like, what in the world did I write? Thanks. Repentance, forgive me, Lord. Spiritual growth. Can you see that? And then seven is service to God. And then I'll write what I want. So prayers. This is another Dollar Tree divider. Um, cardstock and I made it into a divider and again I want the sheen so I'm going to change to the top I don't know why I did that why I put them backwards so that is what that looks like I don't know why it has this line through it I think something was on it or whatever but it'll change once I start decorating it battle armor there you go and I left it the right way and so I'll have paper in between these sections. I just started it yesterday and I'm just working on it today. So this will be the line paper that I have. There is other paper that I will not leave in here. It's just in here because this here had some of these papers already in here. So I love how many pages. One, two, I could actually just go ahead and change it now. I'm putting one sheet of paper in each one for now, but you know me, I like my stuff chunky. And once I start adding stuff, it's going to get chunky. So we have, okay, so the prayer, the prayers, I have one. The prayer journal, I'm going to have in the back. I don't know if I showed you that. That should have been in my brain dump. Here, another tab would be prayer journal. So I'm going to journal my prayers. So prayers, answered prayers, things like that will be here. Prayer journal will be in the back. I'm, a th I'm thinking. Um, okay, so I did that one. That was the prayers. Okay. So battle of armor is the purple one. And I just went purple, green, purple, green. And in the back you'll see blue, the other blue, one pattern, the other pattern. Battle armor, that'll be the battle 
putting your, uh, oh my God, I can't even think right now. And then I got to do a tab for fruit of the spirit. Um, putting your full armor on, I think it is. Yeah, the full armor of God. That'll be that. I just need to print it out bigger. I didn't like that size. So again, lined paper. My next tab, and I like the top tabs because you could just touch the top and you're into your next section. God's Word, the scriptures, and you know me, I love my scriptures. Um, it has paper, so I don't have to worry about that one. Bible study, as it says, Bible study. So in here I have, I don't know if you guys watch Coffee and Bible Time. It's the two young sisters. They're... They're going to Moody Bible Church. Bible, yeah, Bible School. Moody Bible School. It's a college. And they're in Illinois. I don't know where they live, so I'm not going to give that information out because I don't know that. But these girls, you know, they say all the time where they go to school. So that's not like something to get in trouble about. So they have this thing where it says do this daily. And it just was, um, I think last week they just did it. I just printed it out finally, and I'm going to do it this week. It says, do this daily. Oh, you do it daily. Read Luke 9.23 through 26. What is surrender? Is the question. How is salvation a one-time act of surrender? What does it mean to be discipled of Christ? What does it mean to be a disciple of Christ? Why can't you have surrender without obedience? So that is like a little prompting. They always give free printables, so go check them out. They always, they don't know me at all, um, but they do. They always give free printables. And this is one of them. And then it says, I think this is supposed to be first. And then that. And then it says, do this daily challenge. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> that was the question, so let me switch this over. And then I do have paper, just in case. Because of my writing, I have like big handwriting big letters I added more paper besides doing more Bible studies so here it just says um, oh they wrote a little note okay so do this daily find a friend sibling parent or mentor to join you they always say that write out Luke 9:23 to 26 on a note card Meditate and focus on this passage every day for a week so this is a weekly thing it's not just one and done. Um, consider these questions as you reflect on your surrender in these verses. So this one is, what is something that you, what is something that you think you couldn't live without? What is it in your life that you feel you must control? I shrunk this so small so that I'm able to put it in here. So that's why it's hard to read this. Especially with my glasses. I don't know why. What do you not trust God with? Oh my God, that's a... I would never... Is there anything in your life that has become more important than God? What do you need to let go to God? How can you let God take the driver's wheel and direct your life? What would you see as the ideal life? If God has a different plan than yours, would you be willing to give those dreams up to him? Okay, and then next is what does taking up your cross daily mean for the believer? How can you take up your cross daily? Is there anything holding you back from obeying God? And then last but not least, enter into a prayer. Why did the camera change colors? Enter into a prayer of surrender every day. Pray out the verse. Ask God to help your surrender everything in your life to him. Ask the Lord to reveal what you are not surrendering. And then it has something. Surrendering is not easy, but the Lord. I'm reading it down here. But the Lord will help you to take up your cross daily and follow him. So I just thought that was very cute and something nice to put in here. Why did I take the piece of paper out? And then I have spiritual spiritual abundance. With the um, shiny kind of paper, the tabs tend to like try to fall off, but it'll be fine. 
once I decorate it and stuff. So that is done with the top tabs, I believe. I could just add this in here. So these sections will grow because each section has a different thing to it. So like again, um, prayers. These sections will have my mother, my brothers, my husband, my daughter, answered prayers, job, like jobs for both of us, um, like battle, battle armor, that'll have different sections as well. One is battle, and then I can put whatever else, God's word, the scriptures, it'll have different sections. Bible study will have different sections, so the sections will go here, so like each, uh, each tab here so this paper will have a section. The next paper will have a section to what this is. So if I'm faith journaling in my Bible study section, then I will have side tabs for faith journaling, faith mapping, Bible words and verses, faith mapping, Bible characters, things like that. So there's already one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Really? There's only three? Yeah, so three. And then here has six. So there'll be six sections in my prayers and three sections already in my Bible study. Plus I have this. So that's, you know, adding on to it. So spiritual abundance will be the same thing. So going on into different papers. So here I have, and I don't know where to put this yet. This, again, I got from the lady. She did a great job on her little war binder. It's not little. It's a big war binder. She used, I think, maybe an 8 by 8 and a half by... No, not 8 and a half. An A5. I don't know what I'm saying. I think she used that. So it says, God, please awaken me, bring me, call me, calm me, correct me, counsel me, choose me, control me, cover me, deliver me, direct me, empower me, empty me, encourage me, fill me, focus me, Grow me, guide me, heal me, hear me. That's all in alphabetical order. Um, so I went ahead and typed it, put my own font. You know, this is the paper from the 12 by 12 I just got. And then in the back, it's just, you know, of course, the cardstock. Here it says, hold me, increase me, involve me, judge me, lead me, love me, meet, meet me. I was going to say meek, but meet Move me, place me, plant me, prepare me, preserve me, protect me, quicken me, receive me, rest me, restore me, uh, revive me, save me, seal me, search me. Oh, that's a lot of me's. And of course, you know, I can't put nothing straight. And then in the back, I didn't want to put another cardstock with just this little bit. It says, send me, show me, silence me, sit me, strengthen me, tell me, turn me, walk me. And so that would be these two. I don't know where to put them yet. And then this just has my brilliant ideas. This is the back that I'm not too sure of, of what I'll be leaving in here. This, of course, will definitely be staying in here. As it grows, I will be removing things out of the back and then just letting it grow. My brilliant ideas. Just some thoughts. So that's good for, you know, like doing stuff. Again, my brilliant ideas. I don't know why it's backwards. Okay, so this is all my brilliant ideas. I kind of want to fix it as I'm going so I don't forget. And I think I'm going to put my thoughts in front because I like that one better than my brilliant ideas. Because ideas sound like ideas. My thoughts sound like my, you know, like you took sermon notes or something. Your thoughts or whatever. Okay, so that's my brilliant ideas. There's nothing on any of them yet because I just, again, set this up yesterday. Here is Killing It. Oh, it's getting kind of long in this video. Sorry, but these war binders can take some time. Kill It, Killing It. This may not stay, or I might just, you know, take that off because I don't like that word. Killing It. This is just, it just says Treat Yourself Ideas. This is not going to stay. As a matter of fact, none of this is going to stay. So I will take this section out. Because none of that's going to stay. Okay, here it says, I am, I love, I want. This is definitely going to stay. Or, oh, I don't know yet. 
I might leave it in here because it is, I am, I am, you know, a child of God. I love, you know, you can put what you love. I want to go closer to the Lord. It could be something like that. And then write it down. This is just regular note paper, so that could stay. Here is the next tab. Now these tab, these uh, tabs, these dividers will be these subsections probably into the front. I don't know yet, or I might add more because I do want to add a prayer journal where you journal your prayers out. And then here, and then you haven't seen this yet. This is gonna come out. It's just a crafty thing. Highlighter test page. This is from Grace, uh, Grace Cole, Daily Grace. Okay. Daily Grace Call. I always forget the name. I don't really care for it because it looks like a little bunch of crayons on that highlighter, but I don't know. I'm just going to leave it in here because I did do a test page. And then I have more paper. The one paper I do not like, and then this is just all line paper and graph paper, so that could stay. Um, planner is going to plan. It's going to come out because, again, I'm going to do my own dividers. So this can stay. This is the section I do not like. The wrong, wrong girls in here. I don't think that's appropriate. But I have, yeah, this could come out because the last time you, it's like brush your hair or whatever. I don't know. Change your oil, things like that. And then get it done. That could stay. And then my brilliant ideas could go back. Um, to, where did that section go? You cannot mix it. It's got... The orange color okay so that could go here so next you'll be seeing is where I'm actually working in it and then the get it done paper this is the back cover I love that cover look how pretty they creatively and then that's the back to the front so if you like this video give it a big thumbs up sorry it's long um the next couple of videos I'll be doing with faith is my Bible bag and um, actually doing work in here. So, oh, let me show you one more thing before I let you go. These are the extra sheets, or the extra from the cardstock that I will be either tipping in as, you know, cutting them down, tipping them in, adding stuff on here, you know, maybe journaling, things like that will go in here. So that is why I'm keeping these papers and again, these are Dollar Tree, and this is the cardstock from Michaels. So if you like this video, again, give it a big thumbs up. Please subscribe, hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. And I will talk to you in the next video. Have a good day. Bye-bye.